Hey guys, how you doing? This is Dr. Mike. So we get a lot of questions around this time of year about um, athletes and training, especially being the summertime. A lot of parents are investing in personal trainers or training systems for their athlete, their child, different things like that. The one thing that is always tried and true with training, so whether you're doing CrossFit, whether you're doing a Louis Simmons Westside Barbell Powerlifting, standard powerlifting, whatever kind of regimen, explosive, explosion regimen, whatever regimen you're doing, it's going to be great for your athlete, okay? The one thing though that you want to look at is the coach that you're going with, the strength and conditioning coach or the trainer that you're using, and you want to talk to their clients um, and talk to other people or parents of kids that are going to that specific person or that specific facility and you want to see what kind of injuries that are happening. So the best trainer or the best um, strength and conditioning coach is going to have minimal injuries. If you go and you're talking to parents and you realize three or four of these parents' kids have all been out with shoulder injuries or three or four of these parents' kids have all been out with lower back injuries or you consistently see kids hurting their lower back, hurting their hips, knees, and whatever it may be, if the injury is consistently happening to more than one or two kids, it's probably not so much the kid's fault or the train or the training's fault, more so the trainer or the or the uh, strength and conditioning coach. Those are the ones that you actually want to stay away from because those are the ones that are actually going to hinder your athlete or your child's performance versus making them better. All systems are good as long as the coach knows how to implement them with good form and proper training and proper technique. I hope this helps. Share this with your friends and have a great day.